What's up everybody? So, believe it or not, I'm actually doing another YouTube video. We will have to ignore the hoodie, I'm not feeling too great. It's kind of, you know, a hoodie kind of weather and hoodie kind of state of mind, so the hood stays up. Um, I'm actually here to talk about a subscription I actually subscribe to for art supplies. Now, if there's one thing I do, it's draw a lot. And a lot of, before I subscribed to this box, a lot of my art stuff was what I got in school and what I got in college. I couldn't really afford to go out and buy like loads and loads of stuff. So this basic whole pot of pens, apart from minus a few that have come from this subscription thing. There's only like four in there from that. Oh, what I got from college. So I haven't really bought art supplies. They are expensive. Um... A lot of my, well, all of my paints are either from school or college. Um, so I subscribe to this box, which is pretty much just giving me new, exciting materials I can work with. So, school box comes in one of these. If there's one thing you notice about my artwork, it's that I seem to stick with a couple of. Uh, simple things. Apart from this one, this one's actually my tattoo. If you'll notice, that's the one that's on this arm here. So that's the design I actually drew up and took to the tattooist with me. So we worked on that together. Um, some bits that haven't actually been shown up anywhere. And the bit I was actually working on, this, which doesn't really look like much yet. But comment below what you think that's going to be and we'll see who's going to be right so we can guess that I like to do a lot of line work this one is a blackout version so the sticker you get a sticker with it all the time is normally blue so that's normally their colour it normally comes in blue wrapping paper this time it's all black which is actually amazing for me because some of my black pens are starting to run out. So what do you get in this box? It's, if I remember right, £15 a month. Um, and you get art supplies. So we've got, I only got this a couple of days ago so I haven't really exper experimented with any, many of them. I'm actually going to on this piece that I'm just doing. Um, brush pen. I apologise for that. Fine liner, another fine liner, another fine liner. Do love a good fine liner. Brush pen, which I've got a couple of brush pens that will come in the previous boxes. Pen marker, I'm going to be using this a lot in this one. Um, really funky octopus looking brush pen. And. CD, DVD, write a pen, so I guess in like a permanent marker again. Um, on top of that, on, oh no, I have got it, it comes with an art piece about the artist, some paper, which is stacking up lovely in my room, a sweet, which I have eaten, it was a blackjack going with the black theme. I quite like the black theme. Get a little sticker so it all comes up in this wrapping paper. I normally try to peel the sticker off but I don't think this one's going to work. Comes with one of these. So what you get in it. Um, and it comes with a little challenge which I think is a great plus side to this. So it kind of gets you to be creative. I've only done one challenge and I think that was um, a quiet morning, so I actually drew a picture of me reading to my dog, which is downstairs sitting on the computer desk in the living room. Just shut the box and I haven't put the thing in there. In my journal, which is getting rather thick, I each month try to dedicate a page to at least planning some ideas. So. April was take flight, so there's a little stick thing of what I got in each of it, as my ideas. Um, 
I haven't really been very good at planning ideas, so the last couple of months have just been blank. But they are ready there when I am ready to proceed. Bullet journals are good. Uh, going off topic, bullet journals are good. But who finds motivation to fill in every page? So I started a page a week. So you know you have... I started off really motivated. You know, April's looking good, tea sample I got, some pictures I drew, another school box, you know, let it snow, planning the month, you know, again, I got some tape, and then May just went downhill. I hope there's nothing embarrassing in here. June, goals, I didn't even make goals. It's really dark. Again, you know, birthday, dates, school box, cool. When I went to the beach, I got some nice stickers from the arcade. My dad was <laughs> won some stickers. And I went to Hyper Japan, but apart from that, I don't get how people are so motivated. I, I think I'm a pretty organised person, I say, as my desk is covered in paper. These, this is like all my artwork I've done, bits are dropping out. And I just haven't filed away into commission pieces and pieces that just go there and ignore my problems. Like everything else. Oh, books. I might have to do a look around my desk one day, like this, this is terrible, I'm realising how bad I am. But... <laughs> Back on topic, scroll box. So it's great for art suppliers. I have got some really snazzy things in there. Um, it's always topping up my art supplies, so that's handy. Just a little shuffle of work. Yeah, so these, these are the pens I normally use. So I actually bought one with my best friend back in January. Um, we went to the art museum to draw some stuff. And I bought some pens, and that was the last time I actually went out unwillingly bought some art supplies before buying this. Has honest been a lifesaver. So hopefully a little bit of a short video this time. Um, honestly worth checking out. I'll post the link below. Um, comment what kind of materials you like to use. Do you use fine liners, pencils, crowns? Crowns always fun. Paints. What would you like to experiment more with? Um, I used to do a lot of oils works, but I haven't done them in a little while, so I'd probably like to get back into that. But until my next video, take care of yourself.